Good morning. Today we will be discussing, you know, Jupiter benevolent retrogression most afflicted condition from 4th September to 1st January 2024. We have already discussed that Venus on the 4th of September has come in direct motion. Now, within a period of 12 hours from Venus, Jupiter went in retrogression yesterday and it is supposed to be most afflicted condition by the Jyotish classics and classics of mundane astrology. They have condemned its pious condition and the repercussion is huge because it's going to be retrogate till the end of the year on the 1st of January 2024 only it will become direct. It at the time of retrogation it will be with Moon and with Rahu and Rahu is in forward motion when it is with Moon so Jupiter gets afflicted two ways number one by retrogation and by with Rahu forming a Guru Chandal Yog so the financial markets will be influenced adversely it will be the most difficult time for the financial sector especially till Rahu is there with Jupiter till 29th of October 2023. I have already predicted that the country, the whole world will face warlike conditions and an article in this respect will be published in the October edition of the Star Teller, the most popular magazine of India, the most popular astrology magazine of India. And because Venus is becoming direct, so the stocks pertaining to Venus will rise, there will be volatility, but Jupiter going in retrogation is again not good. So primarily, and then it has been observed that when there are malefic planets in the sign Libra, then it is time for break in the stock and financial markets. Mind you, my prediction can go wrong, but it is all research. And by previous happenings, most of the time, if you look at October 1987, October 1929, so whenever Sun was debilitated, and with Mars and Ketu, the market took a hard beating and it, it may prove to be the toughest time in 2023. So, I would alert the players in the stock market who are investing to be very alert and vigilant while investing because if they do not invest at the right time, they can lose money and my disclaimer clause is applicable. Now first, what my nutshell is the, that first the market will be volatile and then it will break. Now the, it has been seen that the effect of the eclipse are seen even before the actual eclipse, although the eclipse is partially it is partial and it is partially visible in India but it has been observed that whether irrespective whether it is visible or not it does when it does influence the planets at the time of eclipse it especially by malefics then it is time for trouble because Mars will be with Ketu aspecting the eclipse in Aries, a solar eclipse, you know, and then Saturn will be also aspecting Rahu, Jupiter in the sign Aries. So it is a most crucial time and there will be warlike situation, especially when Mars enters Libra on the 3rd of October and Mars in the Foundation chart of India will be in the fifth house in Virgo. It is not good till 
Again, there also it is not good. So, my dear friends, you have to wait and watch these situations. Especially in the stock and financial markets, the Nifty, the bank Nifty, and the stocks related to banks, and stocks related to Jupiter may take a beating. But I have mentioned in my previous video also that when planets are retrograde, the normally the stock market rises. But here, due to the eclipse and Rahu along with Jupiter and Moon and Rahu in direct motion will give unpredicted results. So maybe for three days or maybe till it is there in that sign till 29th of October 2023. So this is all friends I just wanted to share. Marriages and species celebrations should be avoided as per the Jyotish classics and especially when Venus is also fallen in the sign Cancer but it is in progressive state and direct. Normally Jupiter, Venus in retrogation is supposed to be very powerful but it should not be fallen. Now it is fallen but direct. So it is little better but all the same it, it is in the sign Cancer and Venus and Jupiter are in Kendra from each other till 5th of October 2023. So this is all friends I just wanted to share, just wanted to alert you and uh, alert you for the investment, be very cautious, this is a time <coughs> to take, do not take hasty decisions, be very prudent about it and my disclaimer clause will be applicable. If somebody loses money on my predictions, I shall not be responsible because it is an educational video and my predictions are based on research. So this is all friends. Thank you very much for listening to me. Have a good day. Bye-bye.